So here we are at your Ernest Hemingway Winery. Why Ernest Hemingway? How did we come to this? I appreciate you guys all coming out today because the whole reason we put this together is to have indoor, outdoor space, the place is comfortable for guests to come in, bring their families. We have a lot of outdoor space here on grass and green areas. If people are willing to join our wine club and love our wines, we want to create space for them to be comfortable. As you saw with the with the new tasting room here, the same thing goes with the lounge, you know, with the couches and tables, mm -hmm. and pool yeah. tables, yeah. shovel board. The interesting and unique thing that we have here is when you come to visit us here, we're going to have Napa wines, Sonoma wines, mm. as well as Central Coast and Paso Robles AVA wines. Okay. They're very unique. They're all single vineyard, single vintage, single varietal, which is very hard to find these days. Not only are we going to have the quality wine, but the quality packaging, and you know something that uh, will inspire people to read more about Ernest Hemingway himself. It's a feeling of history that you brought in with Ernest Hemingway. I mean, that, that's historically, we all know Ernest Hemingway. Uh, I've learned so much about uh, Ernest and his whole family and all the fantastic things he did in his life and what a huge character he was. You know, we try to represent many facets of his life in this winery. It, it's more than just a wine company or a venue, it's, it's the whole package, you know. Hemingway said, uh, wine is one of the most civilized things no, so that's kind of the way I look at it as well, is wine is a universal thing to bring people together. It's a dream come true to get this open, and uh, you know, we look forward to passing on to generations to come and make this a great spot for uh, not only visitors from all around California and the world, but also people here in uh, Paso Robles and San Luis Obispo County. Well, thank you so much again. Thank you for coming. For more information, go to artandwinemagazine.com.